hi-hats. So what are hi-hats? So hi-hats are the pieces of equipment that let you mount, um, I want to say a ball head or a video head like this, big ball heads, big video heads, or smaller ones, to um, a piece of plywood, a board, flat surface, uh, maybe use this in a studio in lieu of tripods or you can actually mount this to top of a tripod to expand its possibilities. Um, they're usually robust pieces of equipment and the one high head we have it is 100% metal, 100% made in USA. Okay, um, I mean the thing's a beast that'll support 200 pounds easily. Look how thick this metal is. Okay, so what we have here, basic uh, features of a hi-hat. Um, so basically we have a base. Let's, oh, this is a nice view here. Um, this base, we have the main mounting screw, which is 3 8 inch. And then we have 2 quarter 20 screws, okay? Uh, now, uh, we, if you want to mount it to a board or whatnot, you could just take this off and then just basically drill a screw or extra screws right into the board here and then just mount it somewhere. So this would allow you to mount uh, like a permanent kind of studio scenario. Uh, you mount the video head for use with the camera, like in the studio that we do here. You know, it's better than using a tripod. We could mount it on a wall or whatnot, you know, however you see fit. Um, let's um, give you the dimensions of this base. So basically center to the edge is it's almost two inches. So that's 50 millimeters. So all the way across, that's 100 millimeters. So um, this here is a 75 millimeter bowl, but the outside diameter of this is 100 millimeters or four inches, okay? That's the 75 millimeter bowl we have in here. Uh, this particular hi-hat that we sell is, when I give it to you, 6.12 inches tall, which is, 155 millimeters, so 15.5 centimeters tall. So this hi-hat uh, comes in two versions. We sell two different uh, versions of this. One with the 75 millime millimeter bowl, just the cup, the bowl, and one with the actual leveling head. And this is how you install it. And it will actually accept any 75 millimeter uh, half ball or ball adapter. So that's how you attach. All right, so after you attach it, it's real easy to pick any angle you like. So this is very important for video heads because they don't have um, you know, they, they don't work like ball heads where you can actually set any level. Okay? So what we want now, we can actually mount any type of head to the top. Okay, so I have our BH1 here. So we can just screw it on if we'd like. And voila! That's it, and now we have a ball head attached to our hi-hat. Okay, uh, I'll show you a video head, but I don't have one right now, but same scenario, okay? And you can just take that off. So that's how quickly and easily you can attach your ball head or anything to the hi-hat. Standard 3.8 mounting screw. So virtually all ball heads have that screw. Uh, now, okay, so I think we got this covered. So I'm going to show you how to attach like a Manfrotto type head. I unscrew it this way because it's quicker. So if we can take this off. And we can put in this big Manfrotto head on there. Okay, let me zoom out a tiny bit. Okay. So what we're gonna do is remove this. So you can attach it this way. Now if the screw's too long for this to put this in, just kind of move it over like so. I'm really not sure why they make the screw so long. All 
right, so now we have it mounted. And notice you have a spirit level here, just like we do on our ball head here or here, okay? So you can use that to help you balance uh, the head. So as you can see now, we're able to select the appropriate angle on this head. Okay, so just loosen this. And then this head has a built-in 75 millimeter half ball, and it's perfect for this high hat. Gives you ample room to adjust with your hand. Just get in there and adjust. Okay, and then once you find the level you like, you tighten it and that's it, it's done. Super simple, okay? And now you can use the head any way you like. So this is um, actually really nice for capturing like a low difficult, low angle shots, using the studio, like a production tool. Uh, it's all aluminum, 100% made in USA. This thing can support 200 pounds easily, maybe more. Uh, <laughs> then you're limited just solely by uh, whatever the head supports, okay? We also have some quarter 20s on the side for additional accessories. Maybe you wanna put like a friction arm or a monitor on the side. Same here, okay? All right, so let's take this off and I'll show you one more thing that can be done with this. So one unique feature of our hi-hat is that this plate is also repl uh, replaceable. Um, it's held in place by these set screws and they can be very tight. So you can just use an Allen wrench to remove it. So if you want to remove this plate, you can replace it. I believe the Gitzel plates work with this as well. Uh, so you can replace it with those, okay. And uh, what you can also do is, I uh, see that's how you can get into this screw with your power drill. Sometimes you could just remove that top plate, okay? If you'd like, uh, our TR42 series tripod plate also fits in the top of this uh, hi-hat. Uh, so we don't sell it this way, but if you'd like to configure it that way, we can swap this plate for this plate, uh, let us know. If there's enough demand, we'll list it as a SKU. Um, so this would be actually really good for just mounting a ball head. You don't have to have a leveling head or whatnot, okay? Um, so let us know if that's something that interests you, and then you just retighten these screws and that grips it in place, okay? Then we have a regular tripod plate. All right, so that's it. Uh, oh, let me, think people ask us for clearance on the, uh, one more question. Um, how big this thing can be, okay? So if you put this here, and this goes like that, I think the longest piece that we can put in there, I would say about 10 centimeters, which is four inches, okay? Uh, maybe a fraction more, like four and a quarter. Uh, this piece here is, I believe that's their short one, three and a half inches. Uh, so that's how long this uh, knob should be. And this is a Manfrotto type knob, but this is ours. Ours is really short. Uh, okay, we're also working on a longer one, but I don't think that's gonna fit this high hat. It's something just for use with the tripods, okay? And this is heavy. This is super light, so um, we're saving a lot of weight using ours. These are not compatible with, uh, with our head. They're, it's different threads. We also make this screw shorter, so it's much easier to put on the, this big old screw. Really not sure why they use such a long screw in here. Okay, all right, so that was the overview of the hi-hat. I think this fell out. Let's fix this. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, let us know. You can always email us pmg at promediagear.com. Okay, thanks for watching.